Hey guys, it's Flamberg here from SHSL Gaming, bringing you another dual com with one of the new clan buddies. Um, his name is Magic. Yo, what's going on, guys? Um, now he tried out as well, but uh, he's not as good as uh, Cruz, but he's a pretty good player. Uh, he's actually a real cool person. But yeah, you guys about to learn about him today? What he thinks about some things that we have. Coming for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy this commentary and let's get started. Um, Magic. So, mm -hmm. I would assume you saw the Black Ops 2 trailer. Uh, yeah. A little disappointed in the fact. Yeah, I am too, but, um, now, since you say that, uh, do you have any expectations for Call of Duty or, uh, Black Ops 2? Uh, well, like any other COD, I'm gonna have to buy the game. I'm kinda obligated to, so. Uh, when I play the game for the first time, you know, I'll check it out. I'll see if it's, if it's any worthy of being, uh, just another COD, or maybe it's, you know, the suckiest game I ever played. Who knows, but, as, assuming from the trailer, I can't say a lot, but all I can say is that it's different. Um, I would agree. Well, I mean, I don't, I don't know. It looks like it's it's gonna be bad because you know that that's a big change in Call of Duty. It's never gone this way. There's been so many, and they've never done a futuristic type thing. We don't know what's gonna be in 2025, so they're not gonna be accurate, and they're just gonna be guessing. Oh, they're gonna have this type of weapon, this type of weapon. Now, I expect them to um, at least try because I trust Treyarch. Um, I really do. I liked that game more than, uh, or I liked Black Ops more than MW3. And they, uh, those games both have flaws, but I actually like Black Ops. So, you know, we'll, we'll see what goes on. But, um, you know, if, if you think, um, this game is gonna end up bad, what do you think it means for Call of Duty in general? Uh, well, since Call of Duty's taken this to like a whole nother level, they're they're just skipping a whole bunch of years. So if this this game has to be good, if this game isn't good, I think Call of Duty's just gonna go downhill because this is their stand to say like we're doing something new and we're pushing the boundaries. So hope you guys like it. But you know, I'd like to agree with you. But um, another thing is they have a uh, other competition now and. uh with Battlefield, they, they seem like they're starting to become a bigger company. Um, Homefront was a great game. And then you have all these other games that are, like, Skyrim and stuff like that. People are trying to find new games, and they're not they're not looking for shooters, so they're going to go to other games. And um, if Call of Duty doesn't step up their game, then they're just going to go downhill from, from uh, Black Ops 2. Yeah, if... I just, there's a whole bunch of games I play personally that I think are much funner than Call of Duty. Mm -hmm. Um, and sometimes I'll stay on that game for like a good month or so, because I, I just can't play Call of Duty sometimes. I mean, it just gets boring, it gets repetitive, and hopefully this Black Ops 2 can be a little bit more fun, uh, because it has zombies, of course, which a lot of people love, and hopefully the multiplayer isn't as, um... Uh, bad as Modern Warfare 3, or even hopefully better. Yeah, well, um, if if Call of Duty thrives uh, with Black Ops 2, where do you see the channel in uh, six months to the end of Black Ops 2? Uh, I see the channel in general, just as the channel, I see it going pretty far. Because you yourself put a lot of work into it, and... Um, your brother also puts uh, some help into there. And with, you know, Black Ops 2, hopefully, if it is a productive game and it is good, you will... I know you can thrive off of that. You can um, build on that because you, you put some good play, gameplay out there, some good commentaries. But if Black Ops isn't what we expect, then it's just another Modern Warfare 3 copy and paste kind of game then, you know, hopefully we can get some other games in there because um, I don't think we'll, you'll be playing that. Yeah, well, um, 
I've been playing World at War and uh, Homefront a lot lately, so probably going to see some of that, actually. But anyways, if if Black Ops 2 uh, helps out Call of Duty, helps out the whole um, the whole series, do you see it lasting for two to five more games, two to five more years? Um, yeah, if if Black Ops 2 can last, if it can hold its ground and say it's a good game, or it's a great game, yeah, I see another, uh, three to four, five, to five games, hopefully, of Call of Duty. Alright, well then, um, let's see, do you, if, let's say, let's say Call of Duty doesn't thrive, do you see, uh, YouTube, or at least the Call of Duty community, going anywhere in the future? Um, yes, I see it going downhill. I don't see it going uphill at all, because you, you don't see commentators <clears throat> commentating a World at War gameplay anymore, or uh, or even, like, uh, Call of Duty 4, for that matter. So, I mean, it's not like if Black Ops 2 comes out and it's a bad game, commentators are going to have to go to Modern Warfare 3 and get some gameplay. I don't think it's going to be like that. If Black Ops 2 doesn't go over the top or it's not a game of um, approval to the players to where they can play it and commentate, I don't see it. I don't see YouTube going any th- anywhere with the community. Are you talking about just the Call of Duty community? Yeah, just the Call of Duty community. All right. Well, um, honestly, I mean, a lot of people have talked about Call of Duty ending if Black Ops 2 uh, doesn't. If they don't do anything, if it's just um, another MW3, I mean, if it's a, another World at War or COD 4, Call of Duty is going to go a lot of places in the future. Because um, what what Treyarch realized is what the flaws, what they had with Black Ops, and then they see that um, Infinity Ward isn't perfect either with MW2 and um, MW3. So then they can just look at those and use them as examples of what not to do, and then go look at COD 4 and World of War and look at what what they should do. Now, um, with that whole futuristic turn, I don't know if it's going to be a good game, but we'll see. Um, we'll see. But um, now, since you're in the clan, you're obviously going to be posting videos, and uh, this is your first video. Where do you see yourself on the channel? Uh, I see myself... As a, you know, a big portion of the channel, like, I'll be putting up videos uh, quite frequently, hopefully. Um, And, you know, I just have a lot of good ideas. I have a lot of, uh, you know, experiences in my life, uh, recent ones, actually, Um, a lot of unlucky stuff. So, I, I mean, I could see myself being a good part of the channel and helping out the channel a lot. So, uh, yeah. All right, well. This commentary is, actually, it's not about to wrap up. Um, I kind of lost track of time, but I honestly see you, like, it. if you would like to do a series, because I can see you doing some type of series. I don't know what, but I can see you doing that. Um, let's see. I don't, I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I agree with you. I do see you being a big part of the channel. Um. I also see Cruz being one of the big parts of the yeah. channel because of his gameplay. I mean, he puts out tremendous scores, like, just outstanding. Um, now, well, if we do what we did last night, because what we did, guys, is we went into a clan. Yes. And um, usually all of us, we just play alone. Usually we just play alone, so we don't do so good, but... I was actually enjoying MW3 when I played with the clan, and um, if we did that more often, no one's going to get gameplays because we're all too good. <laughs> um, we're just going to get owned into games. Maybe maybe one day we'll get a 200 to 0 domination, which I'd like would, to do. That would be something. I would like to do that. Um, that's pretty much it, you know. That's where I see it. I see ourselves going pretty far if uh, I can take advantage of Black Ops 2 when it comes out. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So, anyways, this commentary is about to end. So, this has been Flameberg. 
This has been Magic. And uh, see you guys later. Peace.